Hello my friends and welcome to this video and just like I did not too long ago in F1 2021 I'm back in F1 22 to test out the absolute worst camera settings. Um, I didn't have too much success last time. I remember I did a race in Monza and I failed absolutely miserably <laughs> and I'm back here in another online race. Um, this time at Silverstone which I think will actually be even harder. But yeah so these are the camera settings I'm going to go for today. <laughs> Uh, you can see, I actually just don't have a head. Uh, you can see the sort of collar of my race suit there. As you can see, I've got absolutely zero visibility. So here we go for the start. Alright, that's a terrible start. I need to try and follow the name tags. Oh, the house! What? He's taking me out! Oh, no! <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? What did I do? What did I actually do? Why is that my fault? Right, I'll tell you what, you fat little... This is just an absolutely terrible idea. Wait, that's late. I have literally no idea where I'm going. Even just following the name in front of me is just impossible. This is just horrific so far. Uh, why did I do this? Why did I do this? I don't know where I am. Am I to the left or the right of the track? Oh, I'm in the groove. <laughs> and I'm lost already. Oh, wait, what? I cut the corner. Screw this, man. I have an idea. I'm going to try a race against the AI in Monaco because I think this would be somehow even easier. Um, as I can actually sort of see the edge of the track, it's just the wall. Um, I'm just going to randomly choose Yuki Tsunoda as my driver. Okay, so the online race didn't quite go to plan, but we're here against the AI, who are pretty interesting <laughs> in this okay. game. Okay, so we're starting P10. We are starting the points. Let's try and just secure as many points as possible. It's lights out, away we go. That is a brilliant start from Yuki Tsunoda. Oh my, god, we oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, we just made up two side positions side pretty cleanly as well. See, it's so much easier in Monaco. Nope. Okay, well I've just lost the position. Yeah, it's so much easier because I can actually see where the edge of the track is. Right, we've got to try and go down the inside at the hairpin. Ricardo goes for it from a long way back. Where's, this where's the corner? If he makes it. That, that you know felt what? clean. He has made it. Okay, yeah, this is actually very difficult at this part of the track. Alright, so we've gained one position from the start. Uh, could have been more. This is literally just a test of how well I know the track. I can dare that's enough to break. Oh, I've actually made the corner so nicely as well. You know what, you guys, you need to put some respect on Yuki Tsunoda's name. Look what he has to do every race. In fact, he's still getting points as well. Like this. Fair play to him. Oh, I have just gone to neutral. Whoopsies. Oh, we've hit the wall. I don't know what's going on. I'm just going to wall ride, to be honest. It's not fair. Yeah, I'd say that works. Whoa, Schumacher hit me. What the hell? That's not fair. Yeah, whoa, Schumacher. That is some dangerous driving from him. Look at him. So I made a perfectly clean move there. He just hits me. And then in the next corner as well, wow, look at his steering wheel, he's just turning into me. That's so unfair, so unfair. I'm just going to flash back to um, here, because that was just very unfair. Oh, that's, oh that corner is just impossible. Oh, Schumacher just hit me again. That was absolutely disgusting from him. Was that Schumacher again? Oh, no, Schumacher. Um, God's sake. I don't know I don't even know what's happening. Let's let's just see what's actually happening. I mean I mean is is he in the wrong there? He has just cut the corner and then hit me. Um I mean that was his fault there, he didn't leave the space. I think, I think that's a bit unfair from him. Right, here we go, this is the last lap. I need to make this nice and quick. That was nice. Again, that extended Break. braking, crank the lock on. Look, he can pick the throttle up throttle. so, so early. Again. The oh my god, this is amazing. Don't do a Rosberg. Get nice and close to the wall. Not that close. 
into the hairpin. Let's just turn and... There we go. Two years later, we've made it past the hairpin. What a lap this is so far. Oh my god. Into the tunnel. Get the overtake on. Through that little corner there. Break there. Oh my god, lovely. I think we didn't cut the corner. Honestly, got no clue, to be honest. Now, this corner is the tough one. Look at that. He's so confident. To just Clean enough. The that'll do. The car will live with Leclerc it. Leclerc has won the race. This game is very unrealistic. Around the final corner. What, what a that lap. That, wait, whoa, how is that lap so slow? Okay, well, 118.6 on the final lap with uh, a pretty interesting camera angle, to be honest. Um, yeah, that was a very difficult experience. But we got P9. We actually made up some positions in the race. Leclerc somehow won in his home race. Um, yeah, that just proves that something isn't right with this game. But yeah, that'll be all for this video. That was so painful. I honestly do not do Silverstone with that sort of camera angle or just any track where there's just so much space just past the edge of the track. It's unbelievably difficult. But Monaco, surprisingly, was actually just not as hard. Um, thanks to the walls. But yeah, thank you for watching and I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>